Okay, okay, I can't ignore the elephant in the room. It has come to my attention that during the last video, I recorded a conversation between me and my roommate. It was personal. I was cursing a lot. That's how I talked to my friend. Um, children who are watching these videos or parents, I apologize in advance for the cursing. All right. And for the last five minutes of the previous video, I also made a few mistakes with the um, the mic control. I was supposed to mute during uh, cutscenes, and I failed to do so. I actually did the opposite, and I turned my mic on for the last five minutes of um, cutscenes and etc., which I apologize for too. I was extremely drunk. Not saying I'm sober now, but I was, I was pretty drunk, so my apologies. Let's just move forward. All right, this is the next team, Agents of Shield, covered in the last video. Let's get the ball rolling. All right, blokes. Guess um, I doubt there's anything new in there. Um, I'll just do a quick walk around the perimeter to see if there's any items that were dropped. I always thought you could jump over that. Don't worry, I can usually tell pretty quickly if any items were dropped in this stage. Yeah, there's no... Yeah, there's no items. Okay, so I'll do a quick walk through the um, perimeter. I apologize for sounding like a broken record. Because I'm sure now that um, there's items lying around. Plus, I'm pretty sure we're, we are in the um, process of switching to another base. So, um, yeah, this quick walk is a good idea, considering this is the last time I'll be here. Do you have a question for me? I am glad to be of assistance. Hi, it's good to see you. I hope you're ready for Mandarin, because he's no pushover. No problem. Not sure why they keep asking me about the Mandarin. I'm pretty sure I just cleared out the um the MK or Shang Tsung portion of the game. Um, well, I guess. Oh, we got to move the story for it, or rather, we have to move the story for it. So, I guess I'll talk to the people I have. I'm that's necessary to progress. Deadpool, Black Widow. I've gotta know. Are those real? <gasps> I beg your pardon? Uh, your teeth! Are they real? They're just so darn shiny and straight. You are most welcome. You have the Ultimo schematics. Good work. The lab coats are gonna spend weeks looking at these. Okay, nothing new there. For those of you who are curious, yes, I am a tad bit inebriated. So um, you will notice me doing things like <laughs> not, not walking to the direct next location and, and etc. Alright, let's go. What's new? Did anyone else get an X-Men movie vibe from that? Specifically X-Men 2. You know that whole scene? Alright, one second. 
Greetings, my friends, and welcome to my home, the Sanctum Sanctorum. I realize an aging townhouse in Greenwich Village doesn't quite match the opulence of Stark Tower, but I think you'll find it comfortable. The rest of our team has already moved in. I would suggest you talk to Colonel Fury first. He has information concerning our next mission. Okay, for those of you who are curious, in one of my previous videos, specifically my roster video, I mentioned that you are not able to replace Doctor Strange. This is what I was referring to. Doctor Strange is actually a pivotal part of the storyline, and replacing him in your roster, specifically when using the Gold Edition mod, causes a tremendous bug, um, i.e. his hood and his character just blatantly not being replaced. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Not sure what I just picked up here. Um, but I digress. Did anyone else get an X-Men 2 vibe from that cutscene? That cutscene specifically mimics the scene in the, the second X-Men movie where Nightcrawler is attacking the president. No one? No, I, okay, I guess, I guess I'm alone on this. <laughs> okay, let's move forward. Um... Again, these graphics are gorgeous. This freaking rug, these pictures, the detail. You can see the paint on these pictures, dude. The home of Dr. Stephen Strange. We moved because now that Loki's involved, we're gonna need magic. And there's no better place on Earth for magic than the Sanctum Sanctorum. Professor Xavier has located one of his X-Men in Dr. Doom's castle. That means Latveria is your next stop. For more info, talk to Black Widow. You're free to explore your new HQ. When you're ready to start the mission, use the orb of teleportation near Wong. Hmm. Sweet. A lot of stuff to talk to here. Don't think I want to, though. Where are we? Here? Yeah, we're here. I think we're here. Again, everything in these stages looks absolutely beautiful. Uh, I kind of want to walk around, but I kind of don't care. So I'm just going to try to progress the story. I trust all is in order. Our guests will be arriving soon, and I would hate to be ill prepared. You can rest assured. I have taken all the necessary steps. Ha! An infant could have cast better spells. The heroes have detected your magic and suspect something is afoot. They cannot possibly know the true meaning of the enchantments. I'd stake my life on it. Be careful what you wager. Loki, leave the good Baron alone. What does it matter if the heroes suspect? They will still be ensnared by the trap. For his sake, they'd best be. I'm taking a grave risk being associated with the masters of evil. Make no mistake, my friend. We all stand to lose much if we fail. Which is why I'm certain Baron Mordo will achieve success. But I would warn you, Baron. My faith only goes so far. Failure will not be tolerated, and the penalty will be most unpleasant. What of the mutant amplifier we stole from the Omega base? Does it work? Yes. Even better than I dare hope. But time is now a factor in our plans. Why is that? The mutant amplifier is quite destructive. If we do not move swiftly, the X-Man we kidnapped will die. Ooh, you surprise me, Dr. Doom. Why do you care for the health of the mutant? I don't. An early death would hinder our plans. But make no mistake, death for the X-Men is inevitable. Mark my words, without this reshade, this, these cutscenes, they bombard your eyes with hideous graphics. Like the resolution is so low and the artifacting is so insane that there some portions of these videos are not comprehensible. You must know you're there. Watch yourselves. There could be a trap around any corner. 
And remember, your primary mission is to retrieve Nightcrawler and Jean Grey. Once they're safe, find out whatever you can about the Masters of Evil's next move. On a side note, Senator Kelly was abducted in the middle of the night. The really odd thing is, a jack-in-the-box was left in his place. I have no idea, but keep your eyes open and see if you can find any information on the Senator's location. Oh wow, so I was incorrect. In a previous video I said this is the part where we may be going through hell or something that simulates hell. This is actually, because it's talking about a jack-in-the-box, I'm pretty sure this is the circus level. So you're going to see a lot of different NPCs, which basically another franchise that I chose to plug into this game in a second once we get through this part of Doom's Castle. Just a heads up. If we get through Doom's Castle within these, um, that's odd. Last 30 minutes. Not really much to say. I like the music. It's pretty good music. Kind of tells you what's ahead. If you've played through this game before. Even if you haven't, you'll be aware that there's something silly about to occur. Even though the music is, um, in my opinion, a mixture of something Transylvanian and something circus related. It's giving me both of those vibes. Not really much to discuss here. I usually uh, banter throughout these videos, but I can't really think of anything to converse about. So I guess I'll mute the mic for now and let you guys enjoy the gameplay until I come up with um, something to commentate on. Powers, but how you use them. Awaiting orders. I'm still standing, it'll always end this way. Winter Soldier on site, ready to move.
Enemy contained. I suppose Professor Xavier sent you to save me. Well, he shouldn't have bothered. I am very different. For the first time in my life, I'm free. Free to use my powers without being restrained by Xavier and all the rest of you. He told me you'd say something like that. And he also told me the truth. He said you fear me because I'm more powerful than any of you. Liar! Everyone has tried to stop me from exploring just how powerful I am. Well, I think it's about time I found out. Don't you? Fools! I'll deal with you later. Heroes, this is your old buddy Arcade. I hope you're ready for a fun-filled day at Murder World, because I've got some killer events lined up. I know you've been running yourselves ragged trying to stop Dr. Doom, so I spoke to Baron Mordo. He was able to divert your teleportation spell to my little land of fun and assassination. See how tense you are? This little vacation is just what you need. And remember, no one ever leaves Murder World unhappy. Because no one ever leaves Murder World alive! <laughs> Surprise! I put Power Rangers, specifically Season 1, throughout my game. Power Rangers are fucking awesome. Of course, it's owned by Saban. Um, these models are actually incredible. You're gonna see at least the entire... Well, you're gonna see the entire base roster of Season 1 Power Rangers throughout the game. Thought that was like a pretty... Ah, crap. Thought that was an interesting thing I could litter throughout this part of the game. Plus, I think this circuit stage is really cheesy. And nothing's more cheesy than a Power Ranger. So, um, yeah, that's what I chose to go with. I'll be quiet now. Isn't my dear, dear friends. You're wasting your time trying to save me. You should be worried about saving yourselves. Liar! Arcade isn't controlling me. He set me free. He wants me to use my powers. 
to their fullest. Then it looks like Arcade is going to get what he wants. Test your video game skills and see if you can save your friend. But watch out. There's going to be a few pitfalls along the way. Yes, you are seeing and hearing right. This is Pitfall. This is the oldest game known to man. Right up there with Pong. And it's in the MUA. Christ.
just had the weirdest dream. I attacked you guys at a carnival. Oh, I guess that really happened. Other than feeling like I was hit by a truck, yeah, I'm just great. Now if only my head would stop spinning. I don't think so. The last I saw of Kurt, Dr. Doom had him hooked up to some kind of power amplifier. It looked extremely painful. Arcade was there along with Doom. Find him and he can tell you where Nightcrawler is. Thank God. Okay, save point is open. I'm gonna go save the game, and then um, possibly change the team out. Um, I think it's been about 30 minutes. I don't know where this president guy is either. He's supposed to be here somewhere. Oh, there he goes. I think. If you're planning on torturing me, you're yeah. Meta-humans are nothing but self-serving vigilantes. How do I know you didn't stage this whole event so that I'd be grateful to you? All right, all right. What should I do? Thank you. And I suppose I should apologize. All right, next vid, we'll change the team. Be safe.